hi <laughs> welcome to one and one now this is a very i think sensitive topic for us <laughs> and it's like i think we're laying ourselves bare uh, but yes we're talking about our friendship story and this comes also from the q a episode so please go and watch it um we'll suggest it here um where we were asked like we have such good chemistry do we fight um so i think we just decided by the way i think we just need to tell people the real deal of how this came to be um so that you also get to know us better so this is my story i was at church we used to go in the same church mm -hmm. so Kara is very good in stalking like she has mastered the art of stalking <laughs> stalking where the lies begin so Kara approaches me and she's like yo you seem like a good person you seem bubbly i like you and i'm like this is strange I've never been approached nice. like this before. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> so she goes like, uh, I think you, uh, you fit well uh, with all the qualities I think a friend, a friend can have. I think you, you look like you fit well. Me being the good person I am, why would I say no? So I agree. She, she tells me, let's meet up some time for coffee. And I'm like, ah, I'm not too sure. But I'm like, ah, she approached me. So she looks honest. And I say, uh, well, let's do it. I've never done this before. I've never met someone like this. If we don't have chemistry from the word go, like we're not chatty from the yeah. word go, I don't know if we meet up later that we will be chatty. You get? Mm -hmm. Voila. Kumbe kuna kitu. Kumbe we have chemistry. <laughs> yani kumbe we can talk. <laughs> so, and I think from that moment, we wanted now to meet up more mm -hmm. and we organized for many. So, so then we're going to I think we were in an awkward situation and then we were forced now to talk to each other. <laughs> like there were other people around us and then they were like, like yeah, then we were like, ah, hi. <laughs> but then, kuna pahali. It was just a weird moment. We can't even really describe it. You deserted me. Guys. See, you see, <laughs> this is like a marriage. When I say like a marriage, you know, husband and wife, when I call Sana, so we are doing our things. So, Kara, like a, a circle of friends, she's very friendly, Guy. without even knowing. You, you, you wouldn't even imagine. So, Karo made, uh, like, uh, had another different circle altogether. And me, I'm who thinking, Karo is like my, me, I don't, I'm loyal. <laughs> I'm loyal. So, you think I'm not loyal? So, so she had this circle of friends. They were all moms, and I was not part of that circle, because I was still not a mom. So it made sense, but I kind of it kind of gave us your drift. We we both have different sides of the story because I think it's dependent on how the other person was feeling at the time. Um, because she says I deserted her, but I also felt she deserted me. <laughs> I felt like she felt that because I was I, I became a mom, like Sasa, it's like we wouldn't have conversations to talk or anything. So I think that's the time now we kind of like really hugely diff drifted to the point now at a whatsapp Nothing. call as in zero fine if we meet it to be like hey how are you nini uko sawa nini nini na inaishia hapo yeah. but we were also both not intentional in trying to either pick it up i don't remember when we reconnected i may remember uh, <laughs> when i got pregnant i think you were among the first people they told yeah yeah so that's the time we started reconnecting. Yeah. Oh, I told yeah, you, yes, yeah, yeah, I told you before anyone else. Yeah, and I think that's you now from there we kind of slowly started rebuilding it. Yeah, warming it up. There were times, those I think there was a time we even had that hard conversation. What we're having now is, Yani, you just became a mom and left me. Yeah, you know? well, yeah, yeah now we, we got there's a time, time, I don't remember what it was, but we just decided, maybe, so that we did this, <laughs> what happened. That tough conversation, I think, also helped us reconnect more. Do you trust me, first of all? Or am I on the I... speed dial? <laughs> Those are hard questions. Guys. I know, I so know. You're yeah. asking me if you're, you're Off camera, she was the one who was telling me to ask these questions, and then not. Do I trust you? Hmm. Let me see. Do I trust you? <laughs> <laughs> that is a no. I think in a different nini. Yeah. In a different nini. There's information I know I can give you, like 100%. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. But I, I'm not so sure I can trust you with like uh, at a, like at a, there's a situation where Freddie wants to be killed and then me and then it's between me and Freddie. Oh <laughs> no, I can't yeah, yeah. trust you. Yeah, Depends on who am I against. Yeah, and that's why you know. Okay. Clearly. Yeah. If it's me and your other close friends, I still am a bit wobbly, wobbly, bad. <laughs> I still don't know where I am. Yeah. 
I think it's also kind of the same for me, but I think it's because we've not been able to still hang out just the two of us like we did before. So as much as we've reconnected, I think there's still that gap that we still need to fill. Um, and I think that's why I think maybe the trust thing will come because there are times I've gone through really, really tough situations and my husband has asked me, have you told me about it? And I'm like, are you, are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> so one and one came about where, um, I think there's an awakening, a fire in the belly. <laughs> poetic it's like god was working on each one yeah. each one of us differently mm. like where Karo is she's feeling something like she needs to change something she needs to start becoming an inspiration in a different way mm. same thing happening to me on a different level mm. so we're all going through different things mm. same time mm. but we don't even know it yeah so one day just like have that idea that i'm like let's do this mm. but i'm like who do i do this with and bingo Caro mm. comes to mind and I tell her. She was already doing a mother motherhood blog, which yeah. was doing very well, by the way. And I wasn't to the motherhood thing. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because I'm also quite uh, green mm. in this Maneros. But I was so scared. It was super, I mean, there was a lot of fear, anxiety, all of that. So the funny thing is, I was at that space where, you know what, I'm going to deal with these things head on. <laughs> I wasn't telling you, say <laughs> <laughs> no, I want to try to travel on motherhood. And by the way, for real, this was her idea. It, it has really helped yeah. us with our communication. Mm. So I know I think now it's now for us to even get that time. Like a married couple where you get time as a date night to just focus <laughs> on people um, and focus on us so that right. I think we now rebuild that trust in me because we also don't want it to be that just we're just here. One and one, yeah. one, and one and <laughs> And then after they're living our separate lives, and something happens to her, for example, and everyone's like, "Hey, you don't know." And, and everyone will be asking you, "I thought yeah, you were yeah, 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 and yeah. no, we don't want that whole no. Do you think we'll be in ten years? I think so. Not I, but one I and one, but just I, if we have, if we have something, <laughs> trust me. And why I say that, if we have survived, and it, that break was long, like three years. That break was long. If we survived that and we still rebuilt it. I still think it's possible. Yeah. I still believe, even if one and one will not be there, we will still be friends. I still you know that's it. like a, we we put it out there. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> that's like what I know. If like a bow, yeah, like, like, yeah, like wow. I thought you guys did this. Yes. yes. Also, we've really grown and we've matured where we're now in our thirties. So yes, we've. Pick at a point where we're like, you don't yeah, want. You're not to. meant to say we're. Oh, not. That's, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 just continue. You're not meant to say that to my two. Like they're here thinking I'm 21, and you are throwing at a 31. Ah, uh, you're not allowed to say. <laughs> if you have any questions for us, then I think this should like lead us lead us into another Q and A episode if you want. If you have any questions for us regarding our uh, friendship or even the channel or what content you'd like to see, do let us know in the comment section below. And until next time, peace. One, one, one.